So Jay, here we are, performance facility that Southampton have recently endorsed. What are you doing here today? I'm um, here to op- obviously open it up and uh, just have a look around and see what, what the building's like and what's going on here. So it's a great occasion. There's a bit of similarity between the facilities here and what you've used to at the club recently with your injury. How has your recovery been going? It's been really well. Um, we've been hitting targets and it's been going forward uh, quite quickly and it's um, it's been been quite good really as in I've got a great physio there Matt. Um, he's, he's helped me a lot and it's uh, no, it's been hitting the targets but it's been, been hard work. Form Centre is a new centre um, really on the piggyback of the St George's Park uh, type idea. Um, and we're trying to bring an elite sports medicine, sport and exercise medicine service uh, so that it's available for the whole community, for people from whatever age, uh, doing whatever level of sport or just recreational activities of daily living. Uh, so we're going to try and set up a, a, a truly multidisciplinary approach in an absolutely fantastic new venue. Che is a, a consummate professional, both uh, on the football field but also in rehab. He's really embrace the whole thing. Having an injury is terrible. Having an injury with the timing of Jays just before the World Cup when he was up, up for selection to, to be in the World Cup squad, you know, is terrible timing. Um, he's got over that, he's moved forward, he's working really hard with the physios and doing incredibly well. Of course the work has been ex- extensive for your recovery. How important and how much hard work has there been to be put into this process? Yeah, it is. It's, it's a lot of hard work. Long days and um, a lot of work that's just uh, quite tedious at times, but it's, it's it's really important. So I've got my mind focused on doing that, and and it's it's been it's been good so far. Why well, you've had your mind focused on that? Of course, there's a World Cup coming up tomorrow, so obviously focus will turn to that as well. Are you excited? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing the games on TV. It'll be a, it's a great occasion, the World Cup. It brings everyone together, and it's a it's a great feeling going watching it. So it's uh, it's really good. Of course, over recent months you've made your own international debut. Is the target now the Euros? Um, yeah, obviously my target is to get fit, um, to get full recovery. That's my main thing and, and have a good season after that. Um, but yeah, obviously I'm trying to aim as high as I can, so hopefully that'll, that'll be it. We spoke to you not too long ago, but you're still on target for the same kind of recovery date? Yeah, yeah, no, I've hit, hit the targets. I've not really had any setbacks so far, so fingers crossed it. I won't get any, but I'm, I'm hoping that I won't get any setbacks, but you never know. So it's um, it's all going well at the moment, but I'm taking each stage at a time. We've got two uh, marquee fixtures against uh, uh, European clubs, uh, one away from home, one at home, which we're just about finalising the details now, so we'll be able to announce those as well soon.